for the driver's compartment is in my bag as always, but I need the other guy's key to open the damn thing. But it looks like I've lost it somewhere. If it was a normal key, someone would be sure to turn it in, but this key is different. I'll look for it too, but if you happen to find it, please send it in. Thanks in advance. This note for the conductor is talking about that weird-looking briefcase we just stumbled upon, as the key card to the driver's cab is inside of it. But it's currently locked by those two divots where we need to put something. Let's keep an eye out for the potential keys while we keep exploring the train. Rebecca, is that you? Are you on the goddamn roof of the train making scorpion noises? No! Well, if it's not Rebecca, then it's gotta be the wind. Yeah, I see you out there, wind. Now we're cooking with gas. The 
Its design limits us to two rounds before a reload, but that's hardly an issue because of how we can just, you know, pause the game and reload the gun on the game's menu. We've even got room for our inventory thanks to some very clean editing. Are you terrified of scorpions? <laughs> Not the crossover I'm sure you were all expecting, especially given League of Legends came out, what, seven years after Resident Evil Zero? In all seriousness, though, the scorpion boss, aka Stinger, is a lot more intimidating than he is an actual threat. While his carapace causes regular bullets to bounce off a lot of the time, this lovely little hunting gun we just picked up took most of the heavy lifting for this fight. The basic strategy involves baiting Mr. Pinchy in nice and close, then just aim down and shoot him in his ugly little face. Timing it just right will have him recoil back so we can repeat the process. Eventually, his carapace will be worn down enough that our basic handgun bullets will have the same effect on him. At which point he's about as intimidating as those scorpion lollipops you see in those gift shops. Also, while I'm bringing that up, like, who the fuck are those lollipops for? Have any of you guys actually bought one? I'm pretty sure, like, every scorpion on their grave just asks, Please, please God, don't let them turn me into some kind of sugary snack!
Plus two spaces in these tiny six space inventories is a lot to dedicate to two shots. I can stab my way out of this room. Use it to unjam the door, you idiot. Okay, okay, fine, jeez.
These tanks are used in conjunction with bottles to make Molotov cocktails. The Anarchist's cocktail of choice. Not too reliable as they have a bit of a wind-up on them, but effective for some very particular enemies. Pardon me, excuse me, sir. Service. I've been waiting for my- Oh god, why are you shooting me? Driver's cab. And we also know that the driver's name was Jimmy Lewis. 
Anyway, let's go ahead and head back to the front of the train now, shall we? Scene, they might have been a little more uh, menacing. This way. Roger. Don't touch that. Oh, but he looks so friendly. And we made it. Before we head through, though, I'm just going to stock up on some more healing items. We left some herbs to our left here in the conductor's bunk room so we can get Rebecca to mix these up into a full heal. Billy oddly can't combine herbs in zero, so taking a moment to prep is always a good idea. Delta team, this is Delta team. We have gained control of the train. Over. Understood. This does not make any sense. How was the T-virus leaked? And why did it contaminate both the lab and the mansion, as well as a train almost three miles away? That's irrelevant. We must make sure no knowledge of this gets out. Destroy the train. Completely. How far away are you from the nearest branch line? Did you just say destroy the train? Motherfucker, I'm out. What happened? Hey, Bob, you got a little, uh... Billy, did you just hear automatic rifles? Nah, it was probably just the wind again.
train will either derail or crash. I gotta stop this thing. And then what happened? Uh, I was gonna do like an outro, maybe like a closing joke. Mm hmm. You like making jokes, don't you? Maybe it's your way of coping. <sighs> I was always the weird kid in school. What with the tail and the Animal Crossing speech impediment? Children can be so cruel. I think this is why you're so guarded. There is a wall. Literally. You need to break down this wall. Uh, okay. You're making huge strides. How about a couple more? Bring it in. I'm bringing it in! I'm bringing it in! I'm bringing it in!